The University of Queensland is launching a multi-million dollar pilot facility aimed at producing new vaccines. Live now to Queensland editor Ben Murphy. And Ben, they're looking at producing mRNA vaccines, which is the future. Yeah, good morning, Laura. That's right. A lot of people say it is the future. So just to do a brief explainer, traditionally vaccines use a small amount of a germ or virus which has been weakened or inactive and they put it in your body in order to build up an immune response. But these mRNA vaccines don't require any germ or virus. They just teach your body how to produce proteins which are then able to fight viruses. The mRNA vaccine technology uh, includes Pfizer as well as Moderna as well. This facility is costing $2.2 million the federal government is putting in half and the university is kicking in the other half. This facility is going to fill a key gap between the work that's traditionally done in a research lab and the types of things that you know, would be happening in a large-scale manufacturing facility. So we're going to provide the capabilities and the expertise to help do that scale-up, that translation work that's so important for this new type of uh, therapies and vaccines. The University of Queensland is still working on its COVID-19 vaccine, which was scuttled last year. They're working to re-engineer it, though it will not be using this newer technology. Very interesting indeed. Ben, we'll speak to you soon.